From a young age, I've often pondered why it's incredibly difficult to create something, or build something, but incredibly easy to destroy that very same thing. What property or feature is it about the universe and nature that decides that putting stuff together is a lot harder than knocking stuff down? This will be the first of my hand-drawn ramblings, so hopefully you can learn something new, or at least be mildly entertained, while watching my incredible artistic genius. Anyway, let's start with a simple example of what I mean. If I plant a tree, it can literally take decades to grow. Maybe I have to water it, maybe I have to give it some fertilizer, and then ten years later I might actually end up with a decent-sized tree. But then along comes a man with a chainsaw or an axe, and moments later, the tree is no more. Well, it exists, but it's just a pile of wood, branches and leaves. Boy, that was fast. Sometimes my children and I build towers out of blocks. We spend 10 or 15 minutes building a massive tower, and then what happens? My three-year-old comes along and kicks it, and the whole thing comes crashing down. It took 10 minutes to build, but only one second to destroy. Boy, that was fast. Sometimes we spend an entire morning cleaning up the house. We have guests coming over, so the children help out by putting their toys away and tidying their rooms. I do the vacuuming, and my wife wipes down the tables and benches. The guests come over with their young children, and within 10 minutes, toys are everywhere, juice has been spilt on the floor, biscuit crumbs are all over the carpet, and the house is a mess again. Boy, that was fast. You wind up your earphones and stick them in your pocket. 10 minutes later, you go to get them out, and they're all tangled up. Boy, that was fast. You chop up some cucumber, tomatoes, lettuce, and grate some carrot and cheese. You mix them all together and make a salad. Boy, that was fast. But then somebody asks you to take out all the carrot. It's possible, but would take a very long time. Why is it so much easier to mix stuff together than it is to unmix it? Scientists call this phenomenon entropy, a gradual decline from order into disorder. That's what they call it, but why does it happen? Why is it hard to unmix a salad, or clean up a room, or build a tower from blocks? It has to do with the probability of large numbers. When we clean up our room, we put it into a particular state that we call clean or tidy. This is just one of many possible outcomes, or more depending on how you define clean. But how many different states of messiness are there? An infinite number. There's only one way that we can tidy our room, but to mess it up, there are literally millions and billions of possibilities. By chance alone, the room tends towards a messy state. The chance of it spontaneously becoming clean is near impossible. When we build a tower from building blocks, there is only one state that we define as a tower. Every other outcome results in blocks everywhere. Whether those blocks are all over the floor, or all over the bed, or leaning up against one another, or a mix of all three, is irrelevant. We classify all these states as not a tower. The chances of these blocks taking on the shape of a tower just by sheer randomness is highly unlikely. The more common outcome would be blocks everywhere. So that's why it only takes your three-year-old one second to destroy a tower, but ten minutes to build one. So answering the original question, why is destroying something easier than creating it? Simply put, disorder is a lot more common, and a lot more likely, than order.